गुड मॉर्निंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स आप सभी का आज के समर कैंप सेशन में स्वागत है मैं तनवी आज इस सेशन में जुड़े सभी बच्चों को वॉर्म वेलकम करती हूँ एंड जैसा कि हम जानते हैं आज का सेशन जो है वो पब्लिक स्पीकिंग और आर्ट ऑफ नरेशन के ऊपर तो जैसा काफी बच्चे अब फेमिलियर हैं हमारे साथ आज के सेशन में मेघा मैम जुड़ी हैं जो इस टॉपिक पर आप सभी के साथ डिस्कशन करेंगी और आपको बताएंगी कि हम इसे किस तरह से बेहतर कर सकते हैं राइट right? तो आ, हर सेशन की तरह आपके जो भी सवाल हो आप हमारे साथ चैट सेक्शन में शेयर करते रहें ताकि वी कीप दिस सेशन अ लिटिल इंटरेस्टिंग एंड इंटरक्टिव ओके सो अ वेरी वार्म वेलकम मेघा एंड थैंक यू फॉर ज्वाइनिंग अस इन टूडे सेशन द फ्लोर इज ऑल योर्स थैंक यू थैंक यू तनवी ओके सो गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स अनदर सेशन विथ मी अगर आप मेरे पहले सेशन में आए हो सो यू नो कि अभी तक मैंने स्टोरी टेलिंग कराई है uh, आप सब ने स्टोरी uh, सुनी है जो मैंने सुनाई थी आई ट्राई टू टेल यू की स्टोरीज कैसे बता सकते हैं वॉट इज अ गुड वे टू शेयर स्टोरीज हाउ शुड यू कंट्रोल योर वॉइस वॉट सॉर ऑफ एक्सप्रेशन शुड यू गिव ऑन योर फेस एंड पॉजिज कब लेते हैं एंड थिंग्स लाइक दैट सो स्टोरी टेलिंग इज is like public speaking it's a type of public speaking okay so let's get on with this class and i would like to ask you what do you think is public speaking so i'm waiting for your answers in the comments just give me the answer kya hai public speaking what is public speaking okay i'm waiting what is public speaking okay looks like it's a new topic for you all because i'm not seeing many answers so that's fine um i am going to uh, explain to you what public speaking is just to say class padega you will know okay so maine aapke liye ek diagram banaya tha uh aap is diagram mein dekh sakte ho okay so now some answers are coming shri ram ji is saying speaking the content before a group of people which is right that's the right answer so good uh, shri ram public speaking is जब एक इंसान यू कैन सी द पर्सन इन रेड हियर ही इज द स्पीकर एंड देर आर पीपल इन दस ओके सो वेन देर इज वन स्पीकर एंड मेनी पीपल हु आर लिसनिंग टू हिम दैट्स पब्लिक स्पीकिंग ओके सो रश्मि सिंह टू एक्सप्रेस आर सेल्व बिफोर पीपल दैट्स एब्सोल्यूटली राइट वॉट हैपन्स इन अ पब्लिक स्पीकिंग सेटअप जैसे इमेजिन दैट आप और आपके दोस्त यू कैज आर हैविंग अ कॉन्वर्जेशन यू एंड योर फ्रेंड so there's one person talking one person listening okay and that person also says something back then you listen then you say something then they listen then they say something so this is a conversation in a conversation two people are talking okay one person talks one listens one talks the other listens okay but in public speaking usually the audience is just listening and the speaker is talking okay so you can see i've made a a phone a loud speaker okay so that's so that's to represent that means ki ek insaan baat kar raha hai aur yahan pe audience ke liye maine ye wala action karke rakha hai ki kaan dikh raha hai so audience sun rahi hai so that's usually how public speaking works okay so um udvita ne bola to express our hobby so agar aapki hobby speaking hai then yes udvita tab aap public speaking kar rahe ho at that time बट इट डजन नेसेसरीली मीन कि आप अपने हॉबी को बस पब्लिक स्पीकिंग के थ्रू एक्सप्रेस कर सकते हो कोई कोई हॉबीज हैं जिसमें पब्लिक स्पीकिंग की जरूरत नहीं होती है जैसे स्टिचिंग निटिंग कुकिंग इसमें पब्लिक स्पीकिंग से कोई रिलेशन नहीं ओके सो आई वॉन्ट टू मेक श्योर कि आप सबको पब्लिक स्पीकिंग समझ आया है पब्लिक मतलब एक गैदरिंग है एक ऑडियंस है देर आर पीपल ओके एंड स्पीकिंग यू नो वॉट स्पीकिंग मीन्स टू टॉक सो वेन यू आर टॉकिंग टू मेनी पीपल एट द सेम टाइम आप एक टाइम पे बहुत सारे लोगों से बात कर रहे हो उसको पब्लिक स्पीकिंग बोलते हैं ओके 
have i have you all understood have i made this clear please write in the comments rahul uh, google karne ki koi zarurat nahi hai you don't have to google the answers okay if you know the answers you write it if you don't know no problem you will learn in the class there's no need to google the answers so nandini is saying ma'am one person speaking and the rest are listening yes that's about right okay what about the others is it clear to you all because if it's not then i'll explain again okay so lots of students are saying that they have understood the concept that's great um ab aap mujhe ek aur question ka answer do you all have to answer another question for me okay can you think of a setup jahan pe public speaking use hota hai where do you think public speaking use ho raha hai any example give me any example where public speaking can be used acha till the time you all are answering this question um wait i have got some answers rashmi is saying school stage parth is saying during our school programs uh surekha is saying school so yes all of you have given the right answers some students are saying classroom uh taljeen and suhani you are saying class that's great because abhi right in this moment public speaking use ho rahi hai i am the public speaker because i am doing the talking and you all are doing the listening so isn't that public speaking just because mere haath mein ek mic nahi hai does not mean ki ye public speaking nahi hai just because i don't have a mic in my hand that doesn't mean that this isn't public speaking you're all the audience you're all my audience and i am talking okay so in a meeting that's right workshops oh great answers great answers are coming so um so yeah public speaking is used in a lot of places uh, but before this there was one student who said that they did not understand the concept so i'm going to go back and explain it one more time okay just give me one more minute okay so किसने बोला था कि समझ नहीं आया वादला वादला पूजता यू डिट अंडरस्टैंड नो प्रॉब्लम थोड़ा सा लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड नाउ ओके तो पब्लिक स्पीकिंग तब होता है जब बोलने वाला एक इंसान होता है और सुनने वाले बहुत होते हैं तो जो बोल रहा होता है वो पब्लिक स्पीकिंग कर रहा है इफ यू लुक एट द मीनिंग इफ यू लुक एट द वर्ड ऑफ पब्लिक स्पीकिंग आप इसको अगर ब्रेक डाउन करो लेट्स ब्रेक इट डाउन ओके it's two words right public speaking public means when there is a group of people okay usko public bolte hain ya usko audience bolte hain okay when there is a group of people that's called public okay and speaking you know what speaking is when you are talking so when you are talking to a lot of people at the same time aap ek time mein bahut sare logo se baat kar rahe ho usko public speaking bolte hain okay some great answers have come people are saying ki public speaking kabhi school mein use ho sakta hai programs mein use hota hai functions mein hota hai jab aap speech dete ho that's public speaking in the house also there's public speaking that's true that is um surekha's answer so okay so now we have understood what public speaking is let's go on let's move on and let's see um uh this is this was the question that you all answered you all answered that superbly okay um seminars webinars exactly so traditionally uh public speaking jab hota tha then all the audience all the public used to gather in one place and the speaker used to stand up in facing the audience and talking okay but now because of the internet because abhi hum jaise baat kar rahe hain public speaking can also look like this that aap sab apne ghar pe baithe ho ya school mein baithe ho aur main apne ghar pe baithi hu and we are talking public speaking can look like this as well because the main thing about public speaking is the same that i am that there's one person talking and more people listening now if i say okay i'm going to be quiet now and i'm going to say uh, rehat you have to answer something 
so if you say something and you turn your mic on in other sessions and you are also doing public speaking so in every class rahul has given a great answer he's saying in a hall in a meeting room or in zoom or on google meet when we are talking then we are we are performing public speaking that's really great okay now i want to say जब हमारे शाम के सेशंस होते हैं यू नो द एकेडमी सेशन दैट हैपेंस राइट व्हेन आई आस्क यू अ क्वेश्चन एंड आई टेल यू टू टर्न योर माइक ऑन एंड आंसर दैट इज आल्सो पब्लिक स्पीकिंग व्हेन यू हैव टर्न योर माइक ऑन एंड यू हैव आंसर्ड द क्वेश्चन आपने माइक ऑन करके आंसर किया है किसी भी क्लास में या आपने किसी भी क्लास में टीचर ने क्वेश्चन पूछा है आपने हाथ उठाया है एंड यू हैव आंसर्ड द क्वेश्चन दैट इज पब्लिक स्पीकिंग ओके सो so, आपको लग रहा होगा कि आपने कभी पब्लिक स्पीकिंग नहीं की है बट आपने किया है आई एम हंड्रेड परसेंट श्योर दैट एट सम पॉइंट आप सब ने पब्लिक स्पीकिंग की है इवन इफ यू आर प्लेइंग क्रिकेट एंड द बॉल गोज देयर एंड यू स्क्रीम एंड से ए बंटी गिव मी द बॉल दैट्स पब्लिक स्पीकिंग ओके और इफ लॉट्स ऑफ गेस्ट हैव कम टू योर हाउस आपके घर में बहुत सारे गेस्ट आए हुए हैं एंड यू आस्क दैम कि आप पानी लोगे डू यू वॉन्ट समथिंग दैट्स ऑल्सो पब्लिक स्पीकिंग ओके सो डोंट थिंक कि पब्लिक स्पीकिंग में हमेशा एक माइक होना जरूरी है ओके दैट्स नॉट नेसेसरी एनी टाइम आपने ज्यादा लोगों से बात की है दैट्स पब्लिक स्पीकिंग ओके सो आई होप आई मेड माई सेल्फ क्लियर सो दैट्स टू टाइप्स ऑफ पब्लिक स्पीकिंग एक होता है फॉर्मल फॉर्मल मतलब जिसमें हम स्पीच दे रहे हैं ऑल राइट एंड एक होता है इनफॉर्मल जिसमें आप बस बात कर रहे हो बट यू एड्रेसिंग अ लॉट ऑफ पीपल All right, so there's different types of public speaking. Now, क्या आपने सोचा है कि ऐसा कौन सा profession है या ऐसा कौन सा काम है जिसमें public speaking बहुत use हो Think about it. Think about the different types of professions. You know what professions mean? Professions mean what someone means what someone does for work. So you can be a cook, a chef. That's a profession. You can be a pilot. That's a profession. you can be a teacher that's a profession it's what you do for work okay so can you think of some professions jisme public speaking use hote ho think and give me the answer so i'm getting some answers uh udvita is saying music i think yes if you're a musician if you're a singer and you're singing uh, to a lot of people it's kind of like public speaking but you're singing and you're not speaking so it's a little different also then surekha is saying tv program absolutely right uh, parth has given a great answer he's saying motivational speaker if you are a speaker jo speeches dete hain you give speeches to motivate people to inspire people to make them do something to make them feel good then you're a public speaker okay then we have a uh, charmi who's saying doctor that's interesting that's interesting okay education teaching all sort of professionals requires public speaking that's right artist news motivational speaker so yes i'm seeing some good answers okay now let's see what i prepared for you let's do, let's look at some professions jahan pe public speaking use hoti hai lawyer or a judge If you want to be a lawyer, then you have to be a good public speaker. Okay, there's a lot of public speaking required in this profession. Then teacher, right now I'm teaching you all your teachers who teach you. If they are not good public speakers, if they did not make the subject look interesting, then they then they can't be teachers because teachers teachers का job होता है right कि वो आपको दुनिया के बारे में सिखाएं समझाएं अच्छे से बताएं so they have to be good public speakers. right so i'm seeing lots of answers for teachers so that's right news anchor if you are a journalist right um, and you host news then then you have to be a good public speaker what about tour guide do you all know what a tour guide is a tour guide is someone uh, say i am living in delhi right now and you come to delhi आप लोग दिल्ली विजिट करने आओ बट आपको पता नहीं है कि कहाँ जाना है वे टू गो क्या जगह अच्छी है चार दिन के लिए आए हैं चार दिन में पूरी दिल्ली कैसे घूमेंगे हाउ डू आई लुक एट द होल सिटी सो देन देर इज गोइंग टू बी सम लाइक अ टूर गाइड हु टीचेज यू अबाउट द सिटी हु टेक्स यू टू प्लेसेज हु प्लान द ट्रिप फॉर यू एंड दे टेल यू दे टेक यू टू डिफरेंट प्लेसेज एंड दे से लुक वॉट यूर लुकिंग एट राइट नाउ इज द इंडिया गेट ओके 
and this is when it was built this is who built it all right so tour guides then actors if you want to become an actor whether you want to be a hero like uh, rajnikanth or like shahrukh khan or you want to be um a stage actor a theater actor who does plays who travels then you need to be a good public speaker okay i'm seeing some other answers some people said uh actors have come yes someone said air hostess that's a good one if you want to be an air hostess you have to be a good public speaker that's true because you have to make announcements if you have ever been to an airplane inside a flight or even in the train people make announcements right that this train has reached this platform i request i request all the people to reach platform number 2 the train has reached or some people announce in the flight that please tie your seat belts this is what you should do to be safe politician i miss politician politicians they have to be great public speakers all right rock stars i think yeah rock stars have to be good public speakers as well reporter sanjani likha hai absolutely maine jo news anchor likha hai that's a reporter okay show hosting absolutely police that's right so these are the common professions jahan pe public speaking zaruri hai but think about some other professions all right से आप एक बहुत बड़े रेस्टोरेंट में आप शेफ हो आपने खाना तो बना लिया है बट अगर कोई गेस्ट पूछे कि शेफ को बुलाओ एंड मैं समझना चाहूंगा कि खाना कैसे बना है एंड शेफ कुछ बोल नहीं पाए शेफ को बस खाना बनाना आता है एंड शेफ जब गेस्ट के सामने जाता है शेफ गोज अवे देन इज ही गुड शेफ maybe because he made good food but he wasn't able to talk to his guests if he talked to his guests to uska impression aur bhi acha jamta he would have been a better person he would have been a better public speaker right in the same way think about an engineer you are an engineer you want to be an engineer you want to be a computer science engineer and aapne ek bahut amazing application banaya hai okay this is the best application in the world but when people come and ask you okay friend tell me what's this application about but you get stuck and you don't know what to say uh and you get nervous and you're not able to explain it so even though your application was great you could not explain it to someone and they did not take in it and they thought ha huh, nothing good nothing special so if you think about it in sare professions mein jo screen pe dikh rahe hain every profession that you can see on the screen they require a huge amount of public speaking but some amount of public speaking is required in every profession every trust me because we are always surrounded by people we are always working with people so when people are around us we need to talk to them right and if there's more than one person more than 3 4 people and you can't talk to them that's not great so you all have to become public speakers whether you become a politician and you give speeches or you want to be an engineer and talk about your app we all need public speaking we all need to learn about public speaking okay i got a great answer in the comments someone said youtuber absolutely atharv if you want to become a youtuber you have to know public speaking even though aapke samne physically aap dekh nahi pa rahe ho ki itne sare log baithe hain but itne sare log apne ghar ghar mein baith ke aapke aapki baaton ko sun rahe hain so that's public speaking as well okay um so let's move on from this so now we all know that the different uh, what are the different professions in which public speaking is required a lot and what are the other professions in which we still need need public speaking like if you're a doctor and someone asks you what's wrong with the patient then you have to be able to explain it right so everyone needs to learn public speaking public speaking is a great skill okay you can be the best at your job but if you don't know how to talk to people not great okay so you all need to learn public speaking so let's move on and let's talk about formal public speaking competitions kis type ke hote hain okay competitions public speaking ke kafi sare competitions hote hain in school you must have heard that there's a competition happening okay ab whether or not aapne school mein suna hai we are going to have a competition tomorrow 
on public speaking and i will be the judge and you all will be in the competition you all will be participating in the competition so pay close attention okay and let's learn about the different types of public speaking competition all right so first the first one is recitation recitation usually is for poems okay if you are giving a speech okay if you are giving a speech which is uh, a, you know the difference between uh, prose and poetry right all right so rashmi has given great uh, she's given great answer she said debate storytelling recitation absolutely nandini suhani you've all uh, said speech competition very good so a speech uh, when you write a speech you are writing um in paragraphs okay you are writing full sentences ek sentence then next sentence next sentence next sentence then you finish one paragraph then you go to the next paragraph then next paragraph and when you read that out loud that's a speech okay but you know poems poems also exist right so if you are reciting poems then that competition or that thing is called a recitation you recite a poem when you present a poem tab aap poem ko recite kar rahe ho okay but when you when you give a speech then you are speaking a speech are you understanding the difference a poem is recited all right to so, agar ek poem recitation ki competition hai jisme five people or six people are competing and they all have to come and share a poem and present a poem with a group of people then that is a recitation that's a recitation competition all right now let's move to the next one now i want you all to play to really pay a lot of attention here some of you must be knowing what a debate is but ek debate mein kya hota hai ek debate ek aisa type ka competition hai jisme bahut sare log aate hain aur wo ek speech dete hain theek hai aur is speech ke liye wo bahut research karte hain wo bahut mehnat karte hain kisi kisi competition mein aapko hafta 10 din milta hai to prepare for the speech you get about a week or 10 days to prepare but for some competitions they say okay this is your topic and now you have 2 hours to prepare and you have to go to the library you have to go to the internet you have to go to google and you have to research you have to research you have to write a great speech and then you have to come and present the speech now the interesting thing about debate is that sare jan ek type ki speech nahi de rahe hote hain there's actually two types of speeches that happens ek topic hota hai okay for the competition say the topic is chocolates are good for health okay say that this is the topic chocolates are good for our health then one person speaks for the topic and one person speaks against the topic okay so that means for the topic means ye insaan jo for the topic bol raha hai they are going to say their their speech is going to be about why chocolate is good for health okay and the person who speaks against the topic against मतलब किसी चीज के अगेंस्ट यूर गोइंग अगेंस्ट समथिंग राइट सो यू आर गोइंग टू स्टॉक योर स्पीच इज गोइंग टू बी अबाउट वाई चॉकलेट्स आर नॉट गुड फॉर आर हेल्थ कैन यू अंडरस्टैंड दिस कॉन्सेप्ट सो देर इज वन टॉपिक वन टॉपिक इट्स यूजली अंटेंस लाइक एजुकेशन इज गुड ओके गोइंग टू स्कूल इज गुड और चॉकलेट इज गुड फॉर आर हेल्थ एंड देन some people speak for the topic they say yes this topic i agree with this jo is topic mein likha hai main main usse manta hu main iske bare mein hi bol raha hu and koi log bolte hain against the topic ki nahi ye jo topic hai main iske against bol raha hu okay i'm speak, i'm not speaking for the topic i'm speaking against the topic that nahi school jana acha nahi hai ya chocolate khana acha nahi hai okay So are you all understanding can you all write in the comments if you have understood because i can un i can see why this can be a little confusing so if you if it's clear you can say yes i have understood okay so for a debate one person speaks for the topic one per, one person speaks against the topic can you all write in the comments if you have understood
ओके आई थिंक आई गॉट लेफ्ट आउट फॉर अ सेकंड ओके सो स्टूडेंट्स आर अंडरस्टैंडिंग दैट्स ग्रेट All right, so I'm very, very happy that you have all understood this. This is great. So, so far we've discussed two types of competitions. There's debate that we discussed right now, and इसके पहले हमने poems का अगर competition होता है, not poem writing, but poem presenting. Poems को कैसे हम सुनाते हैं? उसका अगर कंपटीशन होता है उसको रेसिटेशन कंपटीशन बोलते हैं, okay? Poem recitation competition. And if you are giving a speech. All right, and this speech is a debate. It's a debate competition. Then some people will speak for the topic. Some people will speak against the topic, and there's going to be a competition. Okay, so that's a debate. So someone is asking me. Janvi is asking me. Elocution is same like speech. Okay, so let me clear this out for you. So a speech, जो speech है, उसको आप दे रहे हो उसको आप सुना रहे हो एलिक्यूशन इज हाउ यू आर सेइंग दैट स्पीच ओके सो कोई चाहता है कि मैं हिंदी में भी बताऊं अच्छा ठीक है हिंदी में बताते हैं जस्ट अ सेकेंड ओके ओके सो थिंक अबाउट इट लाइक दिस ओके कि आप अपने फ्रेंड के साथ हो आई एम जस्ट गोइंग एक्सप्लेन दिस इन हिंदी फॉर हु एवर डिन अंडरस्टैंड सो बेयर विथ मी ओके तो ग्लिच फायर के नाम से जो है उन्होंने बोला है कि हिंदी में बताओ सो ऑल राइट सो आप और आपके फ्रेंड ओके okay? आप दोनों बहस कर रहे हो कि नहीं मुझे लगता है कि सर्दियां ज्यादा अच्छी हैं और आप बोल रहे हो कि नहीं मुझे लगता है गर्मियां ज्यादा अच्छी हैं तो बेसिकली आप लोग डिबेट कर रहे हो ओके okay? आप लोग जो बहस कर रहे हो इस बहस को ही डिबेट बोलते हैं तो जब डिबेट कंपटीशन होता है इसमें हमेशा एक टॉपिक होता है कि सर्दियां ज्यादा अच्छी हैं, ठीक है सपोज ये टॉपिक है कुछ भी टॉपिक हो सकता है मैंने और एग्जांपल्स दिए थे कि चॉकलेट्स हमारे सेहत के लिए अच्छा है ये भी एक टॉपिक हो सकता है एक टॉपिक ये भी हो सकता है कि स्कूल जाना अच्छा हमारे लिए अच्छा है ठीक है तो इतने सारे डिफरेंट डिफरेंट टाइप्स के टॉपिक्स हो सकते हैं और कोई बच्चे टॉपिक के साथ बोलते हैं कि हाँ ये सही टॉपिक है मैं इसके बारे में बोलूंगा एंड कोई कोई बच्चे अगेंस्ट द टॉपिक बोलते हैं कोई कोई स्टूडेंट्स अगेंस्ट द टॉपिक बोलते हैं कि नहीं चॉकलेट हमारे सेहत के लिए अच्छा नहीं है उसके बारे में एक स्पीच होता है या स्कूल जाना मेरे सेहत के लिए अच्छा नहीं है उसके बारे में एक स्पीच है या सर्दी अच्छी नहीं है गर्मी अच्छी है इसके बारे में एक स्पीच है तो ये जो बहस होता है ये सारे लोग स्पीचेस दे रहे हैं बट कोई कोई लोग टॉपिक के साथ अग्री करते हैं और कोई कोई लोग टॉपिक के साथ डिस करते हैं कुछ सही या गलत नहीं होता ओके पर आपको पॉइंट्स अच्छे मेक करने पड़ेंगे कि आप क्यों अग्री कर रहे हो टॉपिक के साथ या आप क्यों डिस कर रहे हो टॉपिक के साथ दैट्स अ डिबेट जो ये बहस होता है दो लोगों के बीच में दैट्स अ डिबेट एंड वेन दिस इज अ कॉम्पिटिशन ये हमारे नॉर्मल लाइफ में हमने बहुत बार एक्सपीरियंस किया है कि आप कुछ बोल रहे हो कोई कुछ और बोल रहा है समटाइम्स योर सिस्टर सेज दैट शी वॉन्ट्स टू ईट लेडी फिंगर और भिंडी फॉर डिनर बट यू से नो आई वॉन्ट टू ईट आलू की सब्जी और पोटेटोज फॉर डिनर सो दैट्स अ डिबेट दैट 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 आर्ग्यूमेंट दैट यू आर हैविंग इट्स अ डिबेट बट इन अ फॉर्मल पब्लिक स्पीकिंग कॉम्पिटिशन इन अ डिबेट सम वन स्पीक्स फॉर द टॉपिक सम वन स्पीक्स अगेंस्ट द टॉपिक ओके सो आई होप दिस इज क्लियर नाउ वी गोइंग टू मूव ऑन टू अनदर काइंड ऑफ टॉपिक So I want you all to pay close attention to this because this is probably the competition we're going to be having tomorrow. Okay, it's called Jam, and if you pay attention, J stands for just, A stands for a, uh, and M stands for minute. So the name of this competition is Just a Minute. Okay, Just a Minute. So what happens is for debates. I told you right for debates. आपको टाइम मिलता है प्रिपेयर करने के लिए कोई कोई कॉम्पिटिशन्स में जैसे जब मैं स्कूल में थी और मैं डिबेट कॉम्पिटिशन्स के लिए जाती थी तो उस टाइम कभी कभी हमें बहुत टाइम मिलता था प्रिपेयर करने के लिए एक एक महीना भी मिला हुआ है प्रिपेयर करने के लिए वीस टू गेट अ लॉर ऑफ टाइम बट वंस आई वेंट फॉर अ कॉम्पिटिशन वेर वी डिड नॉट नो वॉट आर टॉपिक वॉज गोइंग टू बी 
so we are all standing all the comp- all the people who were competing all the competitors all the participants we were all standing on the stage and then someone came and said that okay this is the topic and then they said okay you have 2 minutes 2 hours to prepare and we quickly went to the library we went to google we figured out what we want to speak on we did research okay and because debate ke speeches long hote hain okay so you have to like 2 to 3 minutes long hote hain so you have to do a lot of research aise sunne mein lagta hai ki yaar 2 3 minute to main bol dunga kuch bhi but actually that's not true 2 3 minutes it's a long time and public speaking you have to be very very like you know you have to be a good public speaker you have to have the attention of your audience if you are boring then you are not going to win the competition okay so i want you uh, i've already written over here what jam is so can you all guess and tell me can you all try to write in the comments and tell me kya hoga maine yahan pe likha hai niche so you tell me okay just try to explain to me if you understood so dinesh is saying that ma'am extempore speaking is also there actually uh, dinesh you are so correct uh, jam jo ye ta- ye ye jo competition mein aapke aapko bata rahi hu jam is a type of extempore competition okay so let me tell you all what an extempore is extempore let me also write it here so that you all know what the spelling is okay So now you all can see on the screen that I've written the word. Uh, oh, Dinesh's path. I'm so sorry. Extempore. So extempore is basically any type of uh, a situation in which you don't get a lot of chance to prepare. It's on the spot. Okay. So extempore me kya hota hai? Aapko topic abhi mila and aapko abhi hi bolna hai. Abhi on the spot. you have to speak on the topic aapko koi time nahi milega to go and google the question or to go to the library and look at the books for some answers or kisi se baat karna ki give me some tip or anything you don't get that in an extempore everything is on the spot okay so just a minute is like that but in just a minute you get one minute so what happens is is competition mein say you all are participating in just a minute okay and i give you a topic okay so i give you a topic and the topic is i love chocolates okay i love chocolates is your topic then i will give you one minute to prepare and i'm going to check the time you will have one minute to think or to write some sentences okay and to prepare and then after one minute is over i say all right time's up now you have to speak and then you have to speak for one minute तो आपको एक टॉपिक मिलता है फिर आपको एक मिनट मिलता है प्रिपेयर करने के लिए कि आप क्या बोलने वाले हो थोड़ा सोचना तो पड़ता है ना थोड़ा सा टाइम मिलेगा आपको एक ही मिनट मिलेगा सोचने के लिए आप उस एक मिनट में लिख सकते हो कि मैं इस पे बोलूंगा फिर इस पे ये फिर ये ओके और उसके बाद आपको एक मिनट मिलेगा बोलने के लिए ऑल राइट सो दिस इज वॉट अ जैम मीन्स जस्ट अ मिनट दैट मीन्स आपके पास बस एक मिनट है ये चीज करने के लिए जस्ट अ मिनट सबसे पहले आपको एक टॉपिक मिलेगा फिर आपको एक मिनट मिलेगा जिसमें आप पढ़ाई जिसमें आप सोचोगे कि आपको क्या बोलना है आप प्रिपेयर करोगे और उसी एक मिनट बस एक मिनट के बाद आपको तुरंत बोलना पड़ेगा ऑल राइट ओके सो आई एम सीइंग सम ऑफ द क्वेश्चंस और आंसर्स दैट यू हैव रिटन ओवर हियर या संजय Have you understood it now? Sanjay, let me know if you've understood, okay? Because you have written that you don't understand it. So yes, Anubhav, uh, you get one minute. You get one minute to prepare, and then you have one minute to speak. Very simple, okay? Okay, now Sanjay has also understood it. 
ऑल राइट सो अभी तक हमने थ्री टाइप्स ऑफ कॉम्पिटिशन अंडरस्टैंड किया है वी हैव स्पोकन अबाउट रेसिटेशन पोएम रेसिटेशन वी हैव स्पोकन अबाउट डिबेट वी हैव स्पोकन अबाउट जस्ट अ मिनट एंड नाउ वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट दिस वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग कॉम्पिटिशन विच इज अ टर्न कोट अ टर्न कोट इज अ मिक्सचर ऑफ अ जैम एंड डिबेट ओके मतलब जस्ट अ मिनट के जैसे टर्न कोट में आपको एक ही मिनट मिलेगा प्रिपेयर करने के लिए और एक ही मिनट मिलेगा बोलने के लिए बट आपको उस एक मिनट में टॉपिक के फॉर भी बोलना है और टॉपिक के अगेंस्ट भी बोलना है सो लेट मी से इट इन इंग्लिश टर्न कोट इज लाइक अ मिक्सचर ऑफ जैम एंड डिबेट विच मीन्स इट्स लाइक यू गेट यू गेट योर टॉपिक फर्स्ट स्टेप यू गेट योर टॉपिक देन यू गेट वन मिनट टू प्रिपेयर एंड देन यू हैव वन मिनट to speak to give your speech and in that one minute where you are talking the the uh, judge will ring a bell okay and they will say okay now you have to speak for the topic so then you speak for the topic you say yes chocolates are really good for our health because when i eat a chocolate it makes me happy sometimes when my guests come uh, to my house and they give me a chocolate i feel really really happy so i think chocolates are good for health because it makes me happy then the other judge will say okay against the topic then you have to say uh okay so chocolates are not good for our health because when i eat a chocolate then sometimes my tooth hurts and i have seen lots of students jinke daant mein keeda hota hai because they because they eat so many chocolates and their teeth are not clean so chocolates are bad for our dental hygiene okay so are you are all understanding when a ek hi minute mein topic ke for bhi bola and topic ke against bhi bola isko turn coat bolte hain to agar ye turn coat pe bahut zyada time hota to isko debate bolte hain aapko bahut time milta prepare karne ke liye agar aapko ek hafta milta ya ek mahina milta ya 2 ghante bhi milte to ye debate hota but because aapko bas ek minute mila hai prepare karne ke liye aur usi ek minute mein aapko topic ke for bhi sochna hai aur topic ke khilaf bhi sochna hai That's stone coat. Abhijit. Okay. Abhijit, you're saying hi a lot. So, what do you want to convey? Okay. So, two students are saying ki. Uh, सुरेखा ने पूछा है कि मैम हम कंपटीशन में कोई सा भी टॉपिक ले सकते हैं ना सो नो टॉपिक मैं दूंगी आपको कल के कंपटीशन में इतने सारे टाइप के कंपटीशन नहीं होंगे कल के कंपटीशन में दो टाइप के कंपटीशन होंगे जैम जिसमें आपको मैं टॉपिक दूंगी और आपको एक मिनट मिलेगा और एक मिनट में आपको बोलना है इसका टॉपिक भी मैं ही आपको दूंगी एंड दे इज गोइंग टू बी टर्न कोट ओके फॉर सम ऑफ द सीनियर स्टूडेंट्स If you are able to do the jam well, then we'll do the turn coat, okay? And uh, is K B topic I will be giving you. So you can't have your own topic. I will select the topic for you, okay? So Anuba was saying that this has been done for a practical in our school. That's really great. So that means you have some experience, and I'll be excited to see how you perform tomorrow, Anuba. Okay. So for the rest of the students. I hope it's clear. Let's focus on two types of competitions right now. Let's focus on jam and let's focus on turn coat. Okay, jam is very clear. You come for the competition. I will give you a topic. You will get one minute to prepare for the topic, and then you have to speak on the topic for one minute. Okay. Uh, and I will mark you on how you are talking. And then there is turn coat. Turn coat may be a little difficult for you all to understand, but it's okay. Um, turn coat, you have you get a topic, you have one minute to prepare for the topic, and you have to speak on the topic for one minute. In that one minute, आपको topic के लिए भी बोलना है, topic के खिलाफ भी बोलना है. You have to speak both for and against the topic. So the judge will say, okay, suppose Anubhav is doing the turn coat. Okay, he is uh, in the competition and he is. he has a speech and he has got in his time to prepare and now he is about to give his speech so i will say okay anubhav speak for the topic then anubhav will speak for the topic and then after some time i'll say okay anubhav speak against the topic and then anubhav has to speak against the topic so is competition mein public speaking to zaruri hai 
बट आपका प्रेजेंस ऑफ माइंड भी उतना ही जरूरी है यू हैव टू बी वेरी अलर्ट यू हैव टू हैव लॉट्स ऑफ आइडियाज सो इट्स नॉट जस्ट अबाउट पब्लिक स्पीकिंग इट्स अ लॉट ऑफ अदर थिंग्स आल्सो गोइंग ऑन इन द ब्रेन कि आप कैसे अपने आइडिया को अच्छे से बोल पाते हो इट्स सो डिफिकल्ट समटाइम्स इट्स सो डिफिकल्ट टू डू दैट okay now okay so uh, parmesh is saying that they can still not understand the types of competition koi baat nahi parmesh main baad mein wapas samjhaungi but for now let me move on abhijit wants me to speak in marathi abhijit i'm so sorry i don't know marathi i only know english and hindi uh, so i cannot speak in marathi i'm so sorry but i will come back Okay, Anubhav wants to know. Uh, please tell me what is against the topic. Okay, fine. Okay, let me explain that to you. One second. Okay, <clears throat> let's do this together. जस्ट ए सेकेंड मैं आप लोगों के साथ ओके सो लेट्स राइट डाउन हम लोग का टॉपिक क्या है से आर टॉपिक इज Our topic is summer. okay so can everyone uh, see the screen our topic is okay our topic is summer is the best season okay now can you all tell me why summer is the best season write in the comments write down your answers summer is the best season aapko kyun lagta hai ki summer is the best season yes why do you agree with this write down just say why you agree write down your reasons main apna reason likhti hu okay and my reason is mangoes for me summer is the best season because summer mein mangoes aate hain and i love mangoes so isliye mere liye summer is the best season okay अब नेक्स्ट रीजन क्या है उसमें मैं चाहती हूं कि कोई आप में से मुझे बताए समर एक अच्छा सीजन क्यों है वाई इज समर द बेस्ट सीजन गिव मी योर आंसर्स थिंक अबाउट इट एंड गिव मी दी आंसर्स ओके सो वी हैव एन आंसर वाओ सो अनुभव इज सेइंग समर इज द बेस्ट सीजन बिकॉज वी गेट टू ईट वॉटरमेलन एंड आइसक्रीम सो वॉटरमेलन लॉट ऑफ अदर स्टूडेंट हैव ऑल्सो रिटर्न that ice cream so looks like ice cream is a big favorite for everyone okay what about uh, someone else okay so someone is writing holidays great holidays and someone else said vacation so we like summer because of summer vacation and holidays oh really good now someone is saying we get to swim in the summer so we can go swimming okay what else let's see going to the beach ooh that one's a good one okay what else what else i see ice cream a lot mango holidays ice cream ice cream ice cream sabko ice cream bahut pasand hai uh picnic that's a good one i love summer picnic so ab yahan pe jagah nahi hai to main yahan pe likh rahi hu theek hai okay very good so now we have enough reasons why we think summer is the best season 
okay now let's think of why summer is not the best season why don't we like summer let's talk about that let's go against someone else has written cold water so i'll add that as well okay now now let's change it now let's change it let's go to why summer is not good okay all right so rajshree has given us an answer rajshree is saying that the temperature is too high that's absolutely correct what else hot sun what else bacche more heat what about pasina kisi ne pasina kyun nahi bola hai so much sweat i hate sweating yeah sun is hot hot sun we've written that sometimes because of the sun yeah loss of farmers wow who gave that answer that's a great answer that's a great 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 answer loss for farmers because itni jyada garmi ho jati hai sometimes it's so hot that it's just difficult for farmers to uh, grow crops so it becomes really difficult okay all right anubhav is saying we can't go to play because it's too hot right absolutely yeah sometimes it's so hot that we can't even go out all right so students that's enough okay now see we have come up with so many reasons why summer is the best season and summer is not the best season so when we were discussing ki why is summer the best season that was that was us going for the topic okay we were going for the topic then and then after that we were going against the topic so is it clear for you all that aise aapne kabhi suna hoga ye muhavra uh, ki har pe, har sikke ke do pehlu hote hain aur every story has two sides you must have heard this before okay so rajshri is saying that school is closed absolutely that's a good reason too uh, when school is closed i miss my friends Okay, so now see we have so many reasons why summer is the best season, and so many reasons why summer is not the best season. So what we have done is, हम पहले for the topic गए, फिर हमने बहुत सारी reasons लिखी why summer is the best season. Then we went against the topic, या हम topic के खिलाफ गए, और हमने बोला कि why summer is not the best season. Okay, मैं कि saying electricity goes a lot of times. So yes, that's a great thing. ओके मैक दैट्स द राइट आंसर सो इज इट क्लियर टू यू ऑल नाउ कि फॉर द टॉपिक और अगेंस्ट द टॉपिक क्या होता है क्या आप सबको समझ आ गया है अनुभव सिंह फार्मर्स कान प्रिपेयर द फूड बिकॉज ऑफ द समर सीजन एब्सोल्युटली इट गेट्स रियली रियली हॉट देयर इज नो रेनफॉल इट गेट्स डिफिकल्ट टू ग्रो क्रॉप्स सो अब कैन यू ऑल टेल मी कि आप लोगों को समझ आया है कि फॉर द टॉपिक या टॉपिक के साथ और अगेंस्ट टॉपिक या टॉपिक के खिलाफ जाने का क्या मतलब है Can you all tell me if you have understood this? Since we have done this activity together, I hope it's clear. Okay. All right. Very very good. I'm very happy to see that you all have understood. You all have understood. So uh, this going for the topic and against the topic, it's used in debates, right? When you have a lot of time to prepare and you have a long speech to give. and it's also used in turn quotes where there is not a lot of time to prepare you only get 1 minute but you have to speak for 1 minute okay and in that 1 minute you have to speak for the topic and against the topic so when we did this activity summer is the best season uh we did very fast we did it very fast you all answered very very quickly so 1 minute if you think about it is actually enough time but is activity ke liye hum sab ke brains saath mein aake kaam kiye we all worked together but in this competition you might have to work alone all right so moving on uh let's uh 
let's move on and let's talk about the do's and don'ts of public speaking okay we will have uh, i think one more class in the evening today to practice there's a class at 5 pm so if you want to practice for tomorrow attend that class all right and we're going to practice how to do public speaking until then let's figure out do's and don'ts do's matlab kya karna chahiye public speaking mein and don'ts matlab kya nahi karna chahiye public speaking mein okay so do's grab the attention of your partner you should grab the attention of, of your audience uh you have to grab the attention of your audience because you can't be boring it's written on the don't section don't be boring right so maybe you can start with a question that uh or you can start with a story agar aap apni speech ko ek question ya story bahut hi interesting story ke sath shuru karte ho tab uh, wo bahut interesting ban jate hai theek hai uh again another do voice modulation so this of course i know you all understand by now because humne storytelling mein itne baar discuss kiya hai that voice modulation is very important so usi ke against don't speak in a flat tone if i explain this whole exercise to you in a flat tone aapko bilkul maza nahi aata aapko bilkul samajh nahi aata it would have been so boring but i kept my voice high low sometimes okay so voice modulation is very important in public speaking you cannot speak in a very flat boring way your audience will fall asleep audience ko neend aa jayegi your public will fall asleep so you have to keep the public engaged all right grab matlab kisi cheez ka attention pakadna grab the attention of your audience okay grab matlab kisi cheez ko pakadna if someone throws a ball at you and aapne usko pakda that means you have just grabbed the ball okay khushi and in the same way you have to grab the attention of your audience audience aapko attention deni chahiye jaise aap sab mujhe abhi attention de rahe ho jo main baat bol rahi hu you are paying attention to that so i have grabbed your attention maine aapka attention pakad ke rakha hai okay snehal is asking me what is the meaning of gestures gestures means hands ko aise use karna koi signal dena jaise agar maine ye gesture kiya इसका मतलब मैं थम्स अप कर रही हूँ मतलब सब ठीक है अगर आपने मेरे लिए खाना बनाया और मैंने बोला हम्म सो so मैंने इस जेस्टर से इस हैंड के पोजीशन से मैंने आपको बता दिया है आई लाइक द फूड दैट यू मेड फॉर मी सो दैट्स व्हाट अ जेस्टर इज अ जेस्टर इज अ साइन एक सिग्नल या एक साइन जो आप अपने हैंड या बॉडी से देते हो ओके सो देन द नेक्स्ट डू इज पॉज वेर रिक्वायर्ड so some of you did the storytelling homework that i gave you and in that i noticed ki aap sab ne kai sare bachcho ne acche se pause kiya tha jab ek sentence khatam hota hai wahan pe pause karna chahiye warna pata nahi chalega ki pause sunne walon ko pata nahi chalega ki ye sentence shuru ho raha hai khatam ho raha hai beech mein hai is there a comma what's going on so you have to be very good with this okay uh, gangadhar is saying pause where punctuation marks are required absolutely correct if you see a punctuation mark you have to pause then okay use your hands okay but don't let your hands become a distraction if you are speaking and you are saying i want you all to listen to me but agar aap wo hath bar bar uthaoge to aapke speech se zyada log aapke hath ko dhyan denge and we don't want that because it's not a hand gesture competition it's a public speaking competition right all right and yeah so sreeka is saying like a symbol absolutely if you give a symbol with your hand that's a gesture like saying this it might mean a question like what are you where are you what are you doing or if uh, i wrote an exam and you asked me megha ma'am exam kaisa gaya aur maine bola that means it went badly and agar maine bola that means it went well तो मैंने बस अपने फिंगर से अपने हैंड से इस जेस्टर से आपको बता दिया है एक चीज ठीक है नाउ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट रूल ऑफ पब्लिक स्पीकिंग ओके द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट रूल ऑफ पब्लिक द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट रूल ऑफ पब्लिक स्पीकिंग इज दैट यू हैव टू स्पीक क्लियरली एंड कॉन्फिडेंटली ओके क्लियरली इज एवरी वर्ड should be should be audible should be heard by the audience agar aap aise dheere dheere way mein bologe to kya fir sare logo ko samajh nahi aayega ki aap kya bol rahe ho because you are not speaking loudly so you have to be loud you have to be clear if i am speaking in this small voice 
um, I don't know if you're able to understand what I'm saying because I'm speaking in a very flat way and I'm speaking in a very soft way. So you may not be able to hear what I'm saying. Okay, so some of you may not have been able to hear what I just said because I was not speaking in a very clear way. I was not being loud enough. I was not speaking in a clear way. I was speaking, I was mumbling. I was mumbling. I was mumbling. I was mumbling. So, okay, that's a don't. A do of public speaking is be loud, be clear, okay? If you have a mic, then you have to be louder. But if you have a mic, you have to be louder. But if you have a mic, maybe you don't have to be that loud because mic already has to be more loud, okay? And confidently. Confidence is what happens? Confidence is something that you feel in your own, that you are not nervous. आपको एकदम भरोसा है कि आप जो बोल रहे हो वो सही है आप श्योर हो आपको अच्छा फील हो रहा है यू आर रिलैक्स्ड ओके दैट्स व्हाट कॉन्फिडेंस इज इन पब्लिक स्पीकिंग ऑल राइट यू स्पीक इन अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग वे यू डोंट स्पीक यू डोंट स्पीक यू नो इन अ वे लाइक आफ्टर एवरी वन वन आफ्टर एवरी वन वर्ड यू यू आर नॉट एबल टू मूव अहेड एंड दैट मींस दैट यू आर नॉट वेरी कॉन्फिडेंट क्योंकि आप रुक रुक के बोल रहे हो so that's not very confident but if you speak your sentences loud and clear in a in a very fantastic way in an interesting way you're using your voice your hands your facial expressions then you're speaking confidently okay so that's do's and don'ts of public speaking and finally public speaking ke three p's prepare practice and present public speaking yes Gangadhar ne bola hai, speak loudly, speak confidently, don't fear, dar na mat, absolutely. Daro ge toh woh dik jata hai, audience ko pata chal jayega ki aray yeh toh dara wa hai, isko yeh achche se nahi bola. So public speaking you have to be very loud and clear. Jab mein aap se baat kar rhi hoti hoon, toh kya aapko lagta hai ki mein dari hui hoon? Ki ma'am toh pata nahi dari hui si lag rhi hai, she looks like she's scared. Do I look scared to you? I don't think so. Because I am confident and I am clear and I know what I'm talking about, I prepare. I put in time before I come and I teach this class to you. I sit down and I, you know, put my notes together. I think about what I'm going to talk about. I put pictures. I put um, some photos. I write down text. I make a presentation for you. So I'm preparing. And you best believe I practice. I practice bhi karti hu, And then I present. So these are the three P's of public speaking. Prepare, practice, present. ओके सो आज के सुबह के क्लास में हमने बहुत सारे थियोरी किया है वी हैव ट्राइड टू अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट पब्लिक स्पीकिंग इज व्हाट आर द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ पब्लिक स्पीकिंग कंपटीशंस राइट एंड व्हाट आर सम डूज एंड डोंट्स ऑफ पब्लिक स्पीकिंग ओके नाउ इन टुडेस क्लास एट 5 पीएम टुडे देयर इज गोइंग टू बी अ क्लास विद मी वेयर वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अ लिटिल बिट मोर अबाउट पब्लिक स्पीकिंग एंड उस क्लास में मैं आप लोगों को मौका दूंगी टू टर्न योर माइक ऑन एंड प्रैक्टिस सो आई एम गोइंग टू गिव यू सम टॉपिक्स एंड यू आर गोइंग टू गेट द चांस टू प्रैक्टिस सो वी आर गोइंग टू डू जैम्स इन द इवनिंग जस्ट अ मिनट आई होप आपको याद है कि जैम क्या था Jam is an extempore, which means कि आपको ज्यादा टाइम नहीं मिलता प्रिपेयर करने के लिए आपको एक टॉपिक मिलता है एंड आपको एक मिनट मिलता है और उसी एक मिनट में आपको सोचना है कि आपको क्या बोलना है आपको माइंड में प्रैक्टिस करना है एंड देन वन मिनट जैसे ही खत्म होता है आपको एक मिनट के लिए बोलना है सो दैट इज अ जैम आज शाम को हम जैम प्रिपेयर करेंगे वे गोना प्रैक्टिस ऑन जैम ओके बच्चों जैसे मेघा मैम ने बताया आज शाम के सेशन के लिए लेट्स बी प्रिपेयर्ड ताकि हम सब अच्छे से इस एक्सटेम्परी जैम में पार्टिसिपेट कर सके एंड वी लुक फॉरवर्ड टू दिस कंपटीशन और आज के सेशन का जो अटेंडेंस फॉर्म है वो आपको आपके कमेंट सेक्शन में शेयर किया जाएगा सो डोंट फर्गेट टू फिल इट ताकि आप अपनी आज की अटेंडेंस इस सेशन की मार्क कर सके सो थैंक यू सो मच डियर स्टूडेंट थैंक यू सो मच मेघा फॉर बींग सच अ वंडरफुल होस्ट एंड टेकिंग दिस सेशन Thank you. I had a lot of fun, students. I hope you all understood. And अगर नहीं समझ आया, don't worry. शाम का class join कर लेना. हम उसमें आपको भी practice कराएंगे तो और अच्छे से समझ आ जाएगा. All right. So don't worry and uh, be confident. That's the most important rule of public speaking. So Tanvi ma'am, अगर uh, शाम का link already ready है, क्या हम उसको यहाँ पे share कर सकते हैं? या वो link बच्चों को WhatsApp group के through मिल जाएगा, right? 
एंड उसके थ्रू वी विल शेयर द लिंक्स तो आप अपने व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप पे कनेक्टेड रहिएगा एंड यू विल गेट इट इधर फ्रॉम द ग्रुप और फ्रॉम द गुरुशाला वेबसाइट सो आई जस्ट शेयर द समर कैम्प का पेज विद ऑल ऑफ यू इन केस यू डोंट गेट इट फ्रॉम द व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप आप इसको इस लिंक से ले लेना ओके जस्ट होल्ड ऑन अ सेकेंड Yeah, so this Shant. practice session is very important. Today's class right. is very important. So Anubhav is asking, ma'am, how to join that link? Anubhav, are you on the WhatsApp group uh, of Summer Camp 2022? Anubhav, are you on that group? Yeah, just give me a second. We are sharing the joining link with all of you, ma'am. Huh? Just hold on a second. So Anubhav, you are on that group. Then you are going to get the link for that in the group. Okay. जो भी group में नहीं है, आप उस group को join कर लो. And uh, to everyone who said that I'm brave and I'm teaching very nice, thank you so much. I really enjoy teaching you all. Okay. Okay. आह तो बच्चों आपके comment section में आपको आज के शाम के session का link दे दिया है. So please save it. और या तो आप अपने parents को या अपने friend को भेज के रख दो through WhatsApp. या फिर आप उसे बुक मार्क करके रख सकते हैं राइट चलो थैंक यू सो मच वील सी यू ऑल इन द इवनिंग बाय स्टूडेंट सी यू इन द इवनिंग एट फाइव